Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars adventure and Starbase. So what are we going to do today? Well, I want to redesign my ship. That's part of it. So in order to redesign this ship, we need these blocks. And I could collect blocks and all that other fun stuff, like you know, harvest these materials here. But I don't know if I'm going to have other people coming in on the server or not. And so with that in mind, since I'm kind of using this as a temporary area that I'm staging from, there's this planet here. Uh, oh no, man. I, I tried to buy a space station, a million. Uh, but, if, but if I go P, let's see if I can rotate this. There's this planet right here. Uh, I think we need to move the box there, I th think. Okay. I think we need to do this. Uh, plot path to current. There we go. Okay, so that's a waypoint now, and it's 10 kilometers away, so it's quite a distance. I'm going to use this ship, of course. And yeah, uh, so let's do that. I'm going to probably... Yeah, let's do that. Let's, let's go flying, since we need to place some things on the planet's surface. So... Let's start going in that direction. Let's stop for a second. Okay, and now let's head towards that direction. Let's see how fast we're going with this ship here. Uh, uh, I am getting up into... Uh, oh, no, okay. So whatever I set the server maximum to, that's the speed. Um, it was my understanding that the speed was going to be regulated by the engines and the, and the size of the engines and everything, but I guess that's not the case. I don't know. So anyways, I'm going to head towards this planet here, and I'm not sure how I can make anything interesting, but I think we're just going to cut right to it, so I'll see you as I get closer to the planet. Flying towards the planet here, and let's, why is it behaving the way it's behaving? Hold on a second here. Maybe it's because it's loading in some chunks. It's going to just slow down here to the stop. Let's see here. I get very crappy frame rate right now. I think it's the planet it's generating, so it's it's transmitting the data, and so it's very <laughs> slow behavior. That's hilarious. Ah, good thing StarMate is still in alpha. Uh, maybe today my computer is just not behaving top speed, but I don't know. So anyway, so as we get close to the planet here. We're supposed to lock into orbit. There, uh, there's these orbits that these planets have, or they rotate. Or, uh, yeah, I think I just locked in. So, as you can tell by the background there, you can see in the background how the planet is uh, slowly moving. So I can kind of turn this, and where's the star? So yeah, so we can look at this star, and you'll see. See, we're slowly moving around the star which is kind of neat and then eventually this side will turn into dark and blah 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 so yeah so I'm just wondering why I got such crappy look at this I got it's twitching back and forth that's hilarious okay I'll be right back okay let's see if this works now I'm, um, stop why are we going up I probably pushed the wrong key so here we go with the planet. So the ship, I, it's kind of wobbly still. Uh, so I found out that my computer is going into some maintenance, some automatic maintenance, and I tried to stop it and it won't let me. So, oh uh, man, this is terrible. It's like wobbling. Okay. So like as soon as it goes into here, so it must be something with the video settings. So let's see if we can mess with the video settings here just to see what's going on. Uh, damage display distance, star count. I wonder if this will. Well, it was 49.6. Let's cut it in half. 
Uh, the houses dropped down by 500. Let's draw only 2,000 segments. Let's see what happens with those settings here. And when all queued up, updates are done. Okay, so let's go into. Is there a chat mode here? There, oh no, that's not it. Um, uh, it's a little bit better, but uh, might be something to do with the segments. So I'll have to kind of play with the settings and see. But let's try and get closer to the planet here and land on it. I'm gonna land. You make it right straight for this place, this flat spot here, and we'll just yeah worry about that. So planets have, I think, gravity, and when you get close enough to them, it it sucks you in. So let's see here. Should be pretty quick here. I'm just letting it kind of drift to see if it stops on its own, which I think it does. Let's keep going, keep going. <laughs> one meter or one meter a second. Okay, so I'm still in orbit, but that is going to change very quickly here. Let's see if we can. I thought there's gravity on planets. Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, this is this is where there's gravity. Okay. Huh, huh. Okay. Let's go up a bit. Kind of hop. Okay. I think this should be good right here. Okay. Now if I go, I think, R to hop out. Bang. Here we go. And... Yeah, it's bounce. It bounced, but it's. Let's see if I can push. Oh crap! Ha ha! Oh, we can still get up here into our ship. Okay. Whew! I was worried about that. Okay, here we are. We're on the surface of the planet. So let's pick up some of these materials here, because I need to make some space, and this is in my way. I'm just right-clicking with my hand tool here, because. Yeah, it's just it works that way. <laughs> So what am I going to do on the planet surface here? Well, I'm just going to place some blocks. I'm going to place a power... Uh, let's see, I think we can just do like this. I think I put power reactor... Left click. Okay, so I think we can do that. And then if we go into our inventory, I have these different things. We got storage, so let's set up some storage. There's a docking module for the ships that I want to kind of play around with maybe at some point. We got a basic factory. Uh, we got some items here. We have a capsule refinery. Uh, micro assembler. There's standard, so it's standard factory, advanced factory, capsule refinery, micro assembler. Not sure what that is, so we'll have to play with that. And this is the a general build block to build items. Well, yeah, you know that. <laughs> to build stuff. Uh, there's some plex doors I have, which are for the entrance of the ship. I kind of need to rethink that idea. And then I got some alloy metal mesh from when I was processing it on myself. So let's see if we can place this stuff and see if we can get something happening. So, first things first, let's put storage beside the power maybe let's see here yeah maybe that will work it's, what the heck I want to suck this up okay there we go so if I go R bang okay so I'm in there that's awesome and you can have them auto pull okay that's cool you can set name on inventory that's pretty neat so we got inventory here so let's let's throw all this stuff in here let's throw that in there and let's throw these guys in here and that's about it okay so now that's that 
the build block is obviously used for building so we can maybe place that over maybe over here yeah maybe and uh, basically what this does if you notice gives you the whole build interface for your planet to be able to place hull structures and whatnot on the planet yeah so that's pretty cool if you're stuck in a block press up okay well that's cool we can do that let's i'm getting bad frame right here on the planet i wonder why hmm i'm gonna have to mess with that kind of you understand why the settings behave the way they do or maybe it's a server thing because i got some heavy lag today because i know my computer's doing some stupid maintenance program so i think that might be the issue because yesterday we didn't have this issue so i apologize if the video is going to be crazy but I don't know, gotta make a video. <laughs> uh, I'm in the mood for making a video, so we're gonna you carry on. So, b basic factory, maybe we can place uh, like that. Uh, let's take a look at this. Basic factory, okay, yeah, let's change production. Mail mesh wedge, basic factory. So, here we can make make hulls blue raw brown hull capsule refinery so we can build but well how do you make this stuff though you know like say I want to build a capsule refinery right oh here we go view production recipe never mind silly <laughs> silly thing so I need crystal composite and alloy to alloy mesh and this is oh, okay it's a micro assembler so this is more the next level up let's see if we change production to i don't know let's i need hulls right gray hulls so if we go c d e f g maybe you can just type in gray is it g r e y i think or a y yeah g r e y and if we go ah oh, here we go gray hull what do we need for Grey Hall Corner? Alloy L Mesh Crystal Composite. So how do we make Crystal Composite? Oh, and so from the Grey Halls we can make the corners. Oh, okay. So, okay, so let's just make the Grey Halls out of this, because I need lots of Grey Halls. Uh, I didn't want to do that. Grey you slot okay gray hull now f to make that i need crystal composite so how do we make a micro assembler okay so we got our factory which is pretty useless so let's uh i probably i bet you need to be in my builder now so let's go into our builder and do th this way okay yeah so we'll place the micro assembler right here so that is, I think, eight or seven. Yeah, eight, okay. So, oh, oh no. No, 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 no. I pushed the wrong key. So we'll do this one, and then we'll do this one, micro assembler. You place a controllable block without having. Ah, uh, we'll take a look at that. <laughs> Okay, micro assembler. This is a capsule refinery, so maybe we can put it right here. Okay, and then we can kind of put these guys like this, and then we can put the more advanced one maybe like this, and then we can put this one here. Please select the place weapon computer first. Okay, but I'm not. I don't need weapon computer. So let's take a look at all this stuff here. Why is this open? There we go. Okay, let's get out of this. Okay. So this is the micro assembler, I think, right? So which means that view production recipe. Scrap alloy, crystal scrap composite. So the capsules make the composite. And that's where the capsule refinery comes in, I think. So, for example, if we take a look at this one, the production recipe. Ah, so 
Shit. Okay, but the ore does produce capsules. Okay, so even these materials... So I, I should actually buy those back and put them, throw them in here. I should have actually just started processing from the start. Oh, well. Well, I guess it's progression, right? You you mine some stuff, you sell it to the, the shop, and then other players can go and buy that material to throw in these processors. You know, it's kind of a, an economy that you can s set up, and, and I don't mind that since I am kind of trying to follow the progression and trying to play the game and all this stuff. I don't know why I started with 20,000 instead. It should have been 25,000, but I'm not going to worry about that too much. <laughs> it doesn't matter to me. So with this refinery, then I can just start it going. Then some of it gets crystal composite, some of it gets metal mesh, and some of it get the capsules. Okay, so basically I want to hook this into into this inventory system. So one of these should be raw materials, and the other should be completed materials. Maybe, maybe this is everything that I can draw from right so anything like blocks and all that stuff okay so how do we do this so go see what's that there's something popping up insufficient energy 244 out of 72 uh, connect Okay, maybe that will do it. Um, how do we get out of connection mode? Oh, yeah, there you go. I think it's it's pull it's producing the capsules. It's should be pulling it from. Let's see there if open block inventory. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, there we go. Ninety-one. One twenty. Okay. So it is pulling the items out, which is beautiful. I was hoping for that. Somehow through my me connecting it. Okay. Cool. So now this is producing capsules. Okay. So maybe we should turn this off. Uh, deactivate production on this guy. I think it's still running even when you're not when you're not okay so now this is basic factory so this is where we can build the gray hulls gray but there's which kind of gray hulls I thought there's advanced and standard standard no okay I'm just gonna take a quick peek into these other factories here this is the next standard factory so if i go change production you see ah gray standard armor because that's what i use Shit. okay view production recipes so i need oh you need actually specific capsules and then you need a composite Alloy metal mesh and crystal composite. You also need sapson and masset capsules, which I obviously do not have. Well, that is interesting. But I can create the gray hull so we can at least start. Okay, so deactivate production for this one, obviously. Okay, so what does this have in it? This would have the advanced, probably the advanced gray. So, for example, if we go change and we go gray and we filter gray advanced armor yeah okay see and then here this is where the capsules turned into the ingots which then are turned in uh, okay so you can see how convoluted the production can really get which is very interesting actually 
So that means we're going to have to plan our factories accordingly. Now, why I don't see the connection line, I have no idea. But... See, exit connection mode. Okay, there we go. So now if I open this one. So this is microassembler, right? This is where we take these and create this stuff. I'm just kind of looking at the capsules here. So there's mass set. So do we have to control how many are produced? That's kind of what I'm wondering too. How do we control the amount of production? Click on item to view or like this. And we'll just have, uh, okay, it doesn't have more information. Okay, anyways, I'm just trying to think out loud here, trying to figure out why. So basically these, so we're, so we're making capsules of the mesh. So you have Certes and Ramit, which, what is those used for? Reproduction. So Ramit makes me crystal composites. Certes, where is Certes? S. See, notice that that, that is, is it, wait, no. Sapson, Highlight, Ceratis, okay, that turns into LML mesh as well. Okay, now, when I'm gonna build th these things, change production, so we need to type, go gray, gray hull, so we need to make gray hull, that's for sure. And it's gonna need LML, okay, so it just, uses the two materials right but then do I take the uh, okay so deactivate so then do I take that hull and do I use it in the advanced at all you might have seen this already but uh, yeah okay so we do use the gray hull okay so I think I can make the gray hull and then I just need to find Sapson and Masset I have no idea what those look like, so maybe we'll go on a little adventure. Uh, let's see. Oh, M. Let's go P here. Planet Core AU64616A8. Oh, there's another shop here, though, that appeared, so we do have to explore space. That is interesting. Okay, so I'm glad that we're close to a shop. So I want to head out this way. And kind of what the plan will be is I want to kind of go go this way. I want to go, I want to head towards the edge. Oh, wait a second here. Let's, I'm just kind of seeing where the spiral arm. Yeah, okay, I'm going to head this way. Okay, I don't have any kind of plan in mind, but I'm going to head this way. Because I want to see kind of what's down in this direction here. Maybe we'll just head straight across. I don't like how the planets, the stars are all lined up kind of evenly like this. I can understand why it looks like this because of the sectors, but I don't know, same note, I don't want that to be that way. So anyways, I'm going to head straight ahead basically uh, this way and we're going to see what we can discover because I uh, no doubt we'll be able to see what these other blocks let's see if i can oh never mind we can actually go right into the zone can i get an idea okay how about the sector so well, that's interesting hey the not as many planets let's check this one out here huh of course the shops we won't see we have to explore the space so I was thinking of heading kind of in this direction. Sorry, I'm just looking at, okay. What happens if we go up? Like, 
does it keep let's see here how far can we go okay see notice there's no plants in there what happens if we go up higher okay so there is stuff in this there's a lot of actually places to explore if you really think about it huh cool so yeah so we need to find um shoot what do we need to find we need to find Masset and Sapson Masset and Sapson I don't think we have Masset and Sapson uh, let's see here if we open this we got Ramit Ceres yeah so we need to go looking so we need to so what we'll do is we'll start this producing okay so we need to connect this block enter connection mode with this one connect to that block okay I see exit connection setup okay enter connection mode just connect this block well it is pulling from there I just don't see the little stripe here we we see this stupid thing like I don't know if that's cable or if it means that it's connected but anyways so let's oh yeah see now it's dark here because we're we're in our world wall the planet is rotating around and so the Sun will come back up at some point so let's go into here let's start this processing uh, let's see this is our alloy metal mesh view production recipe Alloy metal mesh. So we'll throw these in here because I don't need them on me. Okay, and then we. Okay, so we're gonna make gray hulls. So now if I go activate production, this should produce. Yeah, there we go. There's my gray hulls. Yay, yay, yay. Uh, I wish there was a way of setting I want to produce a hundred of these, and then and then stop. All right. Why is this not taking the metal mesh? Okay, so let's put the metal mesh in here. Oh, it's producing capsules right now. 505, 695, 101. But then it should be making more of these unless it's pulling them faster than in what it's producing capsules oh okay so ramet will make ramet capsules and crystal composite Oh, so maybe that's a bad. Uh, okay, so this material should actually get fil get filtered. So, so this should actually not be connected. Okay, and then. Okay. I think we do that. Okay, now. Oh, unless there's something to do with the auto pulling. Maybe that. Maybe that is what's. Let's see uh, if I go open this guy up. So this inventory is completely empty. Oh, okay, the capsules are done. I was like, oh, well, why don't you make capsules? Because the materials are, are used up already. So, disconnect that. So, no wonder it's not producing any more because I don't have any more. And then we got the micro assembler here, which will then take these things and produce. Okay. The crystal and alloy. Okay. No. 
I understand what's going on here. I, I was kind of lost there for a moment, but now I understand. So, with this one, we will go switch connection mode. And we'll go and connect to this block. Okay, and then we will open block inventory. And it should be producing hulls. Let's see here. Come on. Why not? Oh, block inventory. Okay, how about we deactivate production? Okay, and 21. Oh, now I think it's producing again. Let's 22. Okay, perfect. So it is continuing. Yay! Okay, we're going to get off this planet now, and we're going to do some exploration in our crappy ship here. While all those gray hulls are being made, let's hop in the ship and get out of this place. Now hopefully I'll find this planet again. <laughs> I should be able to. Let's see here. Okay, up we go. And... So P, okay. So yeah, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to head probably in that direction. I'm going to find some asteroids along the way. And we'll go from there. So let's end for navigate. Uh, station trade, station beta. Planet, okay. P, okay. So what do we need to do? So we need to... Look for some asteroids, maybe. So, we need to go into this side. There we go. Let's plot the path and kind of make our way that way. Let's see here, where is it? So, our path would be. Okay, past the planet. Okay, well, that's fine. So off we go, and if I find an asteroid along the way, I will stop and harvest it. So I found, I think, some Masset. Let's take a look. Yeah, Masset or Raw, which is, I think that's one of them. I hope so. And I, uh, the other one starts with an S. I just can't remember what that is. So there's some asteroids here that I'm going to harvest. I'm going to harvest these green ones. And I think then we'll carry on back to that waypoint. But I think I'm going to cut the episode here. Oh, wait, right, there's more... That's some more asteroids there. Okay, cool. Yeah, see, they're kind of scattered around in these little pockets of, of stuff, so you can kind of get lost really easily looking for raw materials. But I'm going to harvest what I can, and yeah, and there should be plenty for everybody. <laughs> As we travel out from the core, uh, we should be able to find a lot of these materials. So, yeah, so again, you know, I'm going to travel th uh, this way, 
So if there's anyone else that comes to the server, we got all this stuff here to kind of go through. And, and I'm going to kind of harvest the close things to get the materials I need to expand my ship. But then I do want to go out and actually head this way and kind of live in the more you know, outer areas there just to see what it would be like to do that. So yeah, so thank you everybody for watching. I hope you've enjoyed yourself because I know I surely have. I always enjoy my. Let's, let's check out this purple guy just before we we leave here, just to see what this is. What's that on top of it, man? Is that like lava or? Oh yeah, look at this. Yeah, I, I want that. I want that material. Nice. Let's take some more material from you. Cool. I definitely want that for lighting, whether it's on the planet or. Yeah, it's gonna be useful for lighting. So useful. Let's see what this guy has. Sujil Th Theron's ore. Okay, interesting. This ore is very... It doesn't come from what I expect. So, yeah. So, that's awesome. So, I'm, I'm glad I got some lava. All these we're going to process into materials. That's the plan anyways. And, yeah. I think what will happen is when you see me next, we'll probably be further away from the core, I think. Uh, or maybe we'll work on our ship, we'll expand our ship together, and then we'll go away from the core. We'll do a long trip. We'll prepare for that. So, yeah, in the meantime, I'm going to harvest some asteroids. And, yeah, so thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Bye-bye.